I'd like to show you how to load the sample cell of the MicroCal ITC system. Let's enter the load instrument workspace. The first step is to load the cell. The pipette should be moved out of the way, for example, to the clean location. Fill the loading syringe with about 300 microliters of sample. Slowly insert the loading syringe into the sample cell port and hold it about one millimeter from the cell bottom. I would like to demonstrate how to load the sample cell using this transparent model. Load your filling syringe with about 300 microliters of sample. Slowly insert the loading syringe into the sample cell port. Gently touch the bottom and come back up so that you are about one millimeter from the bottom. Slowly dispense about 150 microliters of sample and deliver a, sh a few short small volume bursts to make sure no air bubbles remain in the cell. Now slowly dispense the remaining sample, being sure not to introduce any air bubbles. Remove any excess sample in the cell port overflow cup using the loading syringe and return it to its storage location and click next. If the pipette is in the clean location, you may need to press the clamps release lever. Now move the pipette to the rest location. Align the hole in the pipette's rotating assembly to the hole in the pipette housing. Insert the FPA. You should feel a soft click. Click next. The instrument is now moving the plunger down in preparation for loading sample. Load about 60 microliters of titrin solution into one of the supplied PCR tubes. Ensure the PCR tubes has its lid properly situated in the key to load location. Now you may move the pipette to the load location. Click next. The instrument is now loading the syringe with the titrant material. After the syringe is loaded, you may move the pipette back to the rest location and detach the FPA and return it to its storage location and click next. If your cell is loaded, you may move the pipette into the cell. Be sure the pipette is firmly seated in the cell port and you may now start your experiment. Click done.